Okay, I'm back. It's May the 1st, 2022. I had to walk up that long hill from the police department up to Como Park, Maryland. Now, we up here. Woo! Going into the neighborhood of Kate Stewart, who is the Bin Laden of Tacoma Park, Maryland. They've labored her in this little town as the mayor. This again is the natural food store that Ben Lawton of Tacoma Park was in cahoots with a realtor out of DC to tear this down and take this parking lot right here and build it up for subsidized homing homes to bring in more immigrants so she can run over. And this is the development that Bin Laden and her little band of misfits they put up. They wanted to remove this parking lot which the citizens use to park to go into this natural food store. She wanted to build subsidized homes on this site right here. And eventually it's gonna move this only grocery store out of Tacoma Park. There is no other grocery store in Tacoma Park, Maryland, other than this little store here. and Bin Laden of Tacoma Park wanted to, to develop this area. And take the only grocery store out of Tacoma Park. Let's go down here where Bin Laden's lair is. Of Tacoma Park, hilarious. Now, it's a different kind of attitude, atmosphere. I'm saying, in this little neighborhood, because this is where the chief terrorist of Tacoma Park lives. They get her their orders 
from her. And the funny thing about it, these people in this neighborhood have no idea. Here's one of Kate Stewart's signs. She's running for council. You go ahead, sir. I'm all right. Say it again? You can go ahead. Well, I'm going to... Okay. All uh, right, you go ahead. He ain't going to bite me. I'm a good guy. I'm a good guy. Don't, don't <laughs> She's running for council, county, county council. Them a little kid, man, say. I love it right now. Black man in the neighborhood. <laughs> she crazy. I'm gonna kid myself. Fuck his little dog up. Think I want if he bite you, you think I want him behind me, I want you in front of me. All these blue signs in here. For governor. Well, Hogan, I guess you're on your way out the door with all these blue signs around this mountain. Look at them. There's another cake to Stewart. This shit ain't red nigga around this mountain. Turn my body cam on. These Officer zero 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 is recording. Ain't got a nerve to tell my. Don't bank on it. His dog will bite. Well, he ain't getting no black meat today. He ain't no dog meat today. He won't bite me. I'm gonna bite his ass back. And that's for real. Look at all these motherfuckers down here walking these damn dogs. The dogs taking they, they pets for walks. And they picking up shit behind the dog. I don't know where they get that from. Picking up shit behind an animal. There's something terribly wrong with a human picking up shit behind the animal. How you doing? How you doing? I'm doing fine. Oh, fake ass. Oh, they scared of blacks down here, let me tell you. Look at this shit here. Good morning. How y'all doing? Doing all right. That's good. <laughs> White people are funny. They have so they they implement fear and aggression on everybody on the planet. But when it comes into their neighborhood, and it, the person is not scared of them, they don't know what to do then. Them fake good mornings and shit. Look at the immigrants over there doing housework. And they come over to America and they turn on real Americans because they've been conditioned to do that shit. Look at this shit. We're at Beach Avenue. It's 
sycamore. Good morning. Oh, she looked at me. <laughs> oh, shit. We got a brother living here. Oh, shit. Oh, a black man living in the neighborhood. She has a lot of flowers. Okay. Good morning. How you doing? Good. How are you? All right. <laughs> Right here is where Ben Lawton lives at. This brown house right here with this wooded gate around. This is Ben Lawton's lair of Tacoma Park. Oh, shit, she got her little sign right outside her neighborhood. Her house, I mean. This is her house. Elms and Sycamore. She got statehood for the people of the District of Columbia. Black Lives Matter as long as you don't go inside that gate. This is where she lives, ladies and gentlemen. Ben Lott of Tacoma Park, Maryland. This is her lair. Come on, fucking dog, look at him. <laughs> Even the dog looking at me like, what is this black man doing in our neighborhood? He did some shit. Fucking dog looking at me like. Mm, mm, mm. He even got the animals turning against the people of color. Boy, America is off the chain. But see, real Americans better start standing up. Because this stuff is getting out of hand. I mean, the dog was looking at, he was slowing up, you know, like, what? What? I wish you would. <laughs> Woo! Mm, mm, mm. Kick his motherfucking ass all the way back to his house if he run over on me. He looked at me like, I wish you would. Look at that, that will be some dog meat. But this is the neighborhood of Ben Laden of Tom Tacoma Park, Maryland. Stay tuned, we're on our way back. We can't even find no patrol cars over here in this area. But they go down to where they can mess with people on Flower Avenue, Langley Park, where they mess with drunks and people like that. Well, they'll venture down through here, but that's where they at now where they can beat up people. See, this is the, this right here is considered the historic district of Tacoma Park, Maryland. Then we have Spring Park over here, city of Tacoma Park. And as you look at this park, you see how clean it is. There is no dumping of trash. None of that over here in this park. Oh my, look how beautiful it is. It has slides, it has picnic areas. Oh my God, listen, look at this. 
Look at this. Look at this. They have a little water area. This is the park where Bin Laden lives. And it says, Do not harm the frogs or remove them. Oh my. Look at this, ladies and gentlemen. But Sligo Mill Conservation Park. Oh, look at this. They care nothing about it. But this park has benches in it. And water runoff. Look ahead, these people following me? Are they following me? These two right here follow me all the way up here. Now they follow me with dog shit in their hand. Oh uh -huh, shit. Uh -huh, they got a grand dragon walking down here. Look at this shit. Yeah, y'all. Look at this. Uh -huh. Good morning. Oh, me, oh, my. These two right here follow me all the way over here. Look at him. He got a bag full of dog shit in his hand. The fuck? You know, that's a, those are, I hate to say it, people who elevators don't go all the way. There is no way in the world I'm going to walk behind a dog and pick up his shit and put it in a bag. Ain't going to happen. That will not happen. But see, this is what happens when you put deranged people into office making the ridiculous laws. Picking up shit behind an animal. Mm, mm, mm. That's why they animals. They're supposed to shit out in the open. And I'd be damned if I pick it up. I wouldn't care if the shit patrol was standing next to me. If he wanted picked up, he picked that shit up himself. Look at this lady. She's so scared of me. She's going in the street. This shit's so fucking crazy. And then she got a half baby. The baby looked like he half black. And she runs into the street. Watch it get me. Look at her. Shit crazy, man. How can you be so scared of another human being when they did nothing to you? I can say they did something to you. She don't even know me and got on the other side of the street because I'm black. I ain't scared of nobody walk on this planet. And there's very few four-legged shit I'm scared of that I won't engage. I ain't gonna say I'm scared of them. I ain't gonna engage them. But I ain't gonna never be scared of a, a four-legged individual. There's another little wooded area.
Americans, it's time to wake up. You know, it's time to wake up. The only way we're going to make this country great again is people pull their pants up, tighten their belt, and say enough is enough, and start building it up. And let me explain this to you. I'm not prejudiced. Wait a minute, I'm not a racist, but I have pre I am prejudiced. Everybody's prejudiced, so don't, but a racist is different. But I'm willing to work with anybody to make life easier, you know? But it, that's not what people want. They don't want it, they don't want it easy. They want all of it. They want all of it. I just want to be left alone. Let me build mine up so I can help build the next one up and the next one. But you see, when you come out and start recording these terrorists, oh, you just open up something, you know? And I love it because I don't back down and not going to back down. You see, this is what they hate. You could record me all day long. As long as you don't put your hand on me and as long as you don't fuck with my shit. But you can stand there all day long and record me. I'll give you electricity to charge your batteries back up if that's what you want to do. Because it don't bother me. But if you're doing something wrong, if you're doing something wrong, that's when you don't want to be on camera. And make no mistake about that. Terrorists and traitors don't want to be on camera because they are doing something wrong. This down here, pull down here. Let me see. Is this Popo in an undercover vehicle? You see, I, I, I ain't got nothing to hide in that. When you approach me, I'm going to approach you. I've seen this vehicle several times, so I don't know if he lost or he's looking for somebody. This is the back side of Sligo Mill Conservation Park. New Hampshire is up there, and we have walked all the way around in a circle, and we have not seen one police car unless this is a undercover unit right here but it may not be this is where the gentleman was taking the rocks out of Sligo Mill Conservation Park
There's the two little fat quails sitting on the branch right there. The branch. Two little fat quails. So, we're back to New Hampshire Avenue. Popular. I guess they consider this the industrial area. And we have not seen one law enforcement vehicle in doing this sweep or patrol vehicle or for doing this sweep there's my deer Back to 6530 New Hampshire Avenue. Stay tuned. Man, you can't be just sitting down doing nothing. Can't be sitting down doing nothing. I say you can't be sitting down doing nothing. Zero. This is the food truck. This is the storm drain that they were throwing their waste down. Off of this food truck. Look at it. As you see, the grease is running off of this truck. Stay tuned. 